Give me that real quick, and then I'm gonna get, get that. Um, you win the first one? Brother. The ninth chapter. The this, ninth is, verse. this is 1 Corinthians 4 9. For I think that the Most High hath set forth us and out the apostles last as they were appointed to death. For we are made a spectacle unto the world and to angels and to men. Can I read it again? For I think that the Most High hath set forth us the apostles last as they were appointed to death. For we are made a spectacle unto the world and to angels and to men. That's right. And we understand that, man. We're made a spectacle unto the world and to angels and to men. And you got even angels looking at us like, yo, damn. <laughs> like they actually you know, looking at it, what we're doing. You know what I mean? Even when we go off, angels like, <laughs> Damn, brothers. <laughs> you know what I mean? But it, it, it's funny because uh, Lake is actually hiding the angels because they were the first fruits. So they're like, damn, big brothers. Like, you know, Lord willing, we didn't like, but hey, we were made a spectacle unto men. The scripture says that what? We've been mocked. We're being, so it ain't, it ain't, it is not amazing to us. We're not amazed at what people say to us, man. You know, other people would be amazed. If you went up to T.D. Jakes, if T.D. Jakes' whole congregation started just laughing at him and mocking him, he'll be probably distraught. <laughs> like, yo, what's going on? He started crying and shit. Like, what are you guys doing? But us, it's like, oh, no, there's another day, another program. You know what I mean? We got scoffers coming on our videos. Don't even read the shit. Don't even really watch it. Start just talking about hoping something whole totally different. Yeah. Hey, yo, that's not even what the sit down was about. Like, what are you talking about? <laughs> we were talking about salvation, the kingdom of heaven. They say, oh, only, only the Negroes are black. Like, what are you talking about? <laughs> We're talking yeah. about putting East on the captivity. Somebody that thinks they're an Israelite would say, but, but reincarnation is not real. Like, yo, yeah. you just you just got to just scoff. Like, yeah. you just got to just scoff. We're always talking about heavenly things and, and, and the greatness of the Lord. And you want to just come at us for, for something that it's not even about, man. You, they're they're going to put up a video. If it'll be 30 minutes long, it'll be up for f five minutes. It's already a dislike. Like, you didn't even watch the whole thing. <laughs> you didn't even watch the whole thing. Or you got people that walk by. You got people that walk by and they shake their head at us, not even knowing what we're saying. Or, or false prophets. Yeah, it is. Yeah, yeah. ISIS. Like what? <laughs> Yo, he would be doing this. But what? The Lord said we'll be the offscoring, man. You know, we are spectacles. So what? Hey, we'll be foolish for the Lord's sake, man. Right. right. We'll be foolish for the Lord's sake. We'll be laughed at for the Lord's sake. That's right. Because that how the saying goes in the world, he who laughs last, laughs the hardest. That's right, yeah. And we gonna be laughing the hardest in the kingdom, man. This is first Peter chapter one, verse eight. Whom having not seen ye love. Well, actually, let me start at seven. Six. Wherein ye greatly rejoice, though now for a season, if need be, you are in heaviness through manifold temptations. That's right. We are we are for a season. This is only a season, man. We're in heavy fold, man, heavy manifold temptations, man. Just being in this flesh is a, is a temptation. You know? We're not saying we're perfect. Like the, our flesh, our flesh is, is subject to vanity, man. So we are subject to go to, to, to going off, man. But what? The scripture talks about putting your flesh under subjection. The spirit is willing, but the flesh is weak. So it's a battle constantly. Uh, Romans the seventh chapter, Paul talked about it, man. The, the battle of the spirit versus the flesh, and it's a and it's a temptation. It's a manifold heaviness because in our body, in our mind, our spirit, we want to do right, but sometimes we just go off and like, yo, what the fuck? We just be cursing out ourselves, man. Like, like the uh, other other apostle did, uh, Gabar did a video. We are our worst enemy. And, that, and it vexes us, and that's how you know, Lord willing, we are part of the elect, because two-thirds, that they gonna, they ain't gonna vex them. Yeah, right. They do wickedness, and then they not gonna think about it. You know what I mean? Let's say something about that, too, what you were saying. Say, I was thinking about that earlier. Like, you had the cat that came earlier to talk about, oh, what are we gonna do about it? And the other guy came, what are we gonna do about it? We are doing something about it. God. We're teaching our people, Lord, statue of commandment. We want to pick up guns? We ain't picking up no goddamn guns. That's easy. If you pick up guns, they can infiltrate, sexual, throw you in jail. They'll kill now, you. They'll kill you. <laughs> but what we're doing, the Lord is bad. The Lord said, I'm going to send my prophets out, destroy the lies of this so-called white supremacist society, Edomite supremacist society, with the truth. That's how you destroy it, and then it's going to manifest. Because everything that you do has to uh, be said first. It's a vision, God. then it's said, then you throw it out in the atmosphere, then it manifests it. That's how Esau got the society. What they said, they contemplated and said, you know what, let's go get a new world. Let's go to a new world. Let's conquer the Indians. They said it. They talked about it. And
and then manifested. Uh, the, the secret, um, what's that, uh, Zeta, uh, Psalm 30 something, the secret, the secret council? The secret council? What is a council? Council is a meeting of, of, of sitting down, of putting, putting out, throwing out ideas of, to one another. And that proves that these motherfucking, these jakes are retarded because they just revolution, like they just, well, they watch too much Rambo movies. It don't work like that. Don't, don't you have strategies? When they go, let's say when a, a ESO is gonna bomb Iraq, when they have military, they have strategy. Okay. We're gonna do this, we're gonna send it, we're gonna do this strategy, we're gonna bomb them, then we're gonna send in the ground troops to do this. That's how it works. The ops. So, the ops. ops. Now we're the special ops through the Spirit of the Lord. And we're under we're under orders, strict orders. Mm -hmm. And the Lord said, teach this word and prophesy. Now, do we know exactly when the Lord's gonna do this thing? No. no. The people will say that. Okay. When is it gonna happen? That's not the point. You got the revolutionary starts here. The revolution of the mind. It starts here, and then you manifest. That's why I said those all the heathen nations, even though uh, Ishmael's picking up the guns, but they 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 intact. How you gonna fight a revolution? Your whole household's all fucked. At least other nations, their families are intact with each other. When you fight a revolution, you, you gotta be tight. Your woman gotta be behind you. Our women are whoring and slutting now. Our children are out of order. Well, the majority of the men have no backbone. And they're not getting bent over, they're effeminate. They have no backbone. So how are you gonna fight a revolution? These things are simple. They watch too much Rambo movies, <laughs> and Commando movies. It don't work like that. It starts here. Now what we're doing is more dangerous than a gun. Exactly. That's easy. You don't to kill well, one, one Edomite or whatever and miss shoot and they're gonna kill you eventually, throw you in jail. What did you do? Nothing. Esau's uh, still gonna rule. Esau's still gonna spread his lies. Chemtrails still can kidnap our children. The truth is this. Now this is dangerous. Cause we're telling our people, the truth, and they can't set us up anyway. Like, yeah. fuck, man. We want these guys to do something so we can lock, beat somebody up, kill somebody so we can lock all of them up. They can't. That's why they have to set something up. Yeah. Like, Agent Provocator. You're going to have a guy probably coming out. Hey, the most high will destroy. He's going to kill somebody, and they're going to create everybody with that. Oh, you yeah. see, they're all terrorists. They're all Arabs. Yeah, you know how on, he's so man. such a, he's so, he fucked up because he wants to be like God, right? And what is and what is the Lord bound by his word? Yeah. So Esau, he tries to be like God, so he makes what? Laws. Lost. And he Esau tries to say that, you know, these are the laws set and therefore, you know, you can't go above the law. Nobody's above the law besides these devils. But yeah. that's why we can come out here and teach because what? It's a freedom of speech, right? Yeah. So Esau can't do nothing against this because he's, his law says that we can come out here and teach his word. Exactly. But now that's why they're trying to set up amendments and, and re reconstruct the constitution and all these other things so that they can actually try to take us off the take us off the street. But if obviously if we went out there and tried to actually pick up arms, which is only the niggas that tell us to pick up arms, they're not the ones they're doing not picking it. Up yeah. arms. They want us they to go do it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. They, they, <laughs> they don't want to have an exodus out of America. They don't want to do nothing. And then the main thing is this. We're teaching nationality, we're teaching that it's like foreigner thing. See, with that Black Panther stuff, you're not black, you look like a cracker, we're gonna kill you. That's carnal. We tell you what, through the Spirit of the Lord and the prophets, the biggest secret is the confusion of faces. God. The white robes. That's, that's the mystery, biggest mystery. That's a mystery. The so they're like, fuck, now this is like foreigner thing. That's why it's very important we push it out. They, they, they can't say, oh, these guys are a black supremacist group, like ISUBK. They're wearing all black. And then they'll never have the Northern Kingdom brothers there, like Puerto Ricans. They'll have them not come to the uh, VH1 and all them shows. They'll have all black, they'll have Judah all dressed in black. So in your mind, it's subliminally like, wait a second, it's some Black Panther shit. Mm -hmm. Black Hebrew, yeah, one guy, a Black Hebrew, Black Panther. Like, what the fuck is that? You're gonna have Israelites that look like other nations about nationality. That shit opens a box of over warrants. And you know what that does? That's why there's a vibration on the right hand side. That's why Esau has to combat that on the left hand side with the chip. With the chip. Like fuck, now we now everybody knows that Israelites scattered, so we gotta we gotta chip everybody now. That's it. Because if it was just black, or now we just gonna chip everybody that look black. Exactly. But now that the truth is coming out where Israelites is all throughout the four corners, like, oh you know what? Everybody gotta chip. get chipped. That's it. <laughs> hey, manifesting it. You say it and it manifests. Man uh, yeah. My sister said that. She said she said, yo, that not every Israelite's gonna look like us. We obviously look like Israelites. You know, Israelites that look like other nations, but they're for, and then she was like, yeah, that makes sense. You see, that's why they'll never put us in the media. They can't control that. And the guys that's not pushing us like foreigners, you gotta watch out with them guys. All this black, black. You gotta keep your eyes on guys like that. That is like foreign things, very important, man. God, God, yep. That's one of the mysteries of the kingdom. And that's one of the keys to see who, who the fuck sold out to. Who's a fucking agent. That's how you watch out. Them guys that's not teaching Israelite foreigners, those 
Also, guys, that's not cheating at all. Also, guys, you gotta fucking watch out for all this black, black. Like ISCBK, you gotta watch out with guys like that, man. They sold out. They sold the fuck out. We didn't take no goddamn money. Because obviously we didn't take no money. And we ain't gonna take no goddamn money, man. We want your goddamn devil's blood. You Rothschilds leaves, we want you in fucking slavery. And we at the time where the Lord's gonna actually, we're saying it now. And it's gonna manifest. Right. It starts in the mind, then you say it, you throw it in the atmosphere, and then it manifests actually. Right. Hey, that's what even the Lord said it to even to gain salvation. He said, "What well, you gotta believe in your heart and confess with your mouth." Yep. Everything is a confession, man. Confession. Every publish, publish his name. God, exactly. And that name is powerful. You say that name in the atmosphere, it travels. That's it, why people are waking up. Mm -hmm. Earthquakes, diverse places, elements are getting roused up because that word is getting out and it's going in the atmosphere and it's causing the elements through the angels. To tear shit up. Uh, this thing is powerful, bro. Do you know what it's doing through the spirit? I was, I was meditating, meditating on this uh, other day that we're speaking the spiritual. We're speaking in the spiritual. Like you said, it's, it's making the, uh, the angels actually on the, on the in the in the spiritual dimension. It's making them act, mm -hmm. and it's it's bringing the spiritual world more close to the third dimension. And watch why the days are speeding up too, because they're what they're they're they're, they're working in the in the in the, uh, in the fifth dimension, fourth dimension. They're working in the spirit world. <laughs> they're working in the spirit world, and it's making everything on, on on the third dimension move quicker. And what does it say about the angels, ministers of fire? The ministers of it's God. gonna cause it so much. The Most High Spirit's gonna be into the fire. God. So it's shaking shit up, and the angels are gonna get roused up, and they're gonna do the missiles. Those are the angels. Like, you see the our, missiles. Our words are like a portal. A portal. God, that's what it is. So when you see when you see the missiles, you're looking at it as a missile, but in the spiritual world, it's actually angels. God. Like 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 human torch. God. It's actually yeah, yeah, angels. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> the angels are fired. This thing is yep. bad, bro. Yep. Actually, when you look at Genesis, basically what, what Yahweh was doing was putting out a vibration and everything was manifesting from there on. So it's like, let there be light, let there be this, let there be that. The vibration will come out and then everything will just fall into place by the angel's hands. So that's what we're doing, basically. That was the action. Pushing it out, pushing out the vibration, and then everything's going to manifest in the spiritual world. I like that. Hey, hey, hey. That's what you said. Yeah. 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 You know, that's what a lot of people are going to be saying in that oh, day. <laughs> They're going to be saying that in that day. Okay. They're looking up, about to, get their head, look, about to get their head chopped off, <laughs> saying, I'm Jesus, I'm sorry. <laughs> he was like, no God. <laughs> no, no Jesus. <laughs> hey, man. And you know what? And it's a sad thing because she could have got the truth right now, you know? Yeah. But, you know, our people... If it's meant for her, she'll get it, you know, sooner or later. But, you know, our people would just, you got a lot of people, the scripture says, that, um, that uh, let the multitude perish, which was born in vain. Mm. So you got a lot of Israel that was just really just born in vain, man. For the sword. They was born for the sword. Them that are sent to death, to death. Them out to the famine, to the famine. Them out to the pestilence, to the, uh, to the, to the dogs, to the animals, you know. It's, it's, it's going to be a lot of, it's going to take a lot of death, a lot of blood. <laughs> in order for them to understand, you know, what what, is, what this really is about, man, because this is not a game. And you got a lot of people, you got a lot of false teachers out there that's taking this as a game, man. Like how the brother said, they're not pushing out the 100% the truth. You got a lot of people that's not actually revealing the wicked. They're not talking about the elites, all right? They're making this a... a, a a black community thing, you know, uh, uh, you know black, we gotta make our community better. Well, we're not talking about the people that's fucking up the community. We're not talking about these uh, these devils, man. This is, that's why the Lord, man, even the Lord was talking about these devils. He said, what, the, the prince, the, the now the prince of this world come, he has nothing in me. He was, he was condemning these devils back then, man. And that's the same spirit that we're coming in, man. God, hey, there you go. That's another, that's another uh, 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 a separation. Because obviously these devils, they're not called the elites for no reason. This devil, I'll never forget this. This devil go by the name of Lord Jacob Rothschild. <laughs> Like you, really? That's your, ti that's your title? <laughs> Yo. Like I know you say you want to be like God, but like, <laughs> no. damn! That's no, you gotta adjust me as Lord Jacob. That's funny. How it <laughs> Lord Jacob. Lord Jacob, and you're a fucking man. And that's what. Give me that in um, uh, 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 Isaiah the 30th chapter where he says that uh, the Egyptians are not, they're not God, they're, they're men. I think it's a 30, 30th chapter, the first verse, or the 30. Second or thirty-first chapter? Nah, nah, definitely go to the 